back to Booster Therapy, your cure for that pack cracking addiction. We have got, surprise, surprise, another box of Theros Beyond Death. And for this box, it is another box that is sponsored by a patron. This box goes out to Mr. Ryan Burns. And uh, I'm hoping it's going to be a good one. I feel like it's going to have a lot of mythics in there. So best of luck to you. And hope you nail it. You get a big, juicy box filled with mythics and useful cards and all that fun stuff. If you'd like to support us, guys, easy to do. You can always like the video. That's the simplest, most passive way you can probably do it. You can subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. Share with your friends. Otherwise, check out the links in the description. Become a patron, buy cards, all that fun stuff. But let's jump into the video. And we're going to start out with uh, Temerit Calls the Dead. And a mountain. Temerit's always calling the dead. Just let the dead sleep already. Enough already. That's enough of that, alright? Ooh, Underworld Breach. I do like that card. And Daxos. Blessed by the sun. Alright, well, let's see what we can uh, what we can do here. See what we're capable of. I think we can do some things. Eh? Oh, camera's getting angry. Arresta of the Endless Web. And Hero of the Games. Just a straightforward Hero of the Games. It's sort of uncommons here off camera. Let's make my life a little bit easier later. But man, oh man. I'm not sure exactly when this video will post, but it might be February already. So if it is, happy February. Happy February to you and all of yours. Oh, Adilic Tutor. I am very pleased to see you hit that card. Good old Tutors. I'm glad they reprinted that. Maybe these EDH, you know, type cards that are able to get down to a little bit cheaper is always nice. And Citizen Champion. Another great, solid rare out of this set. There are so many in here. Don't let the prices fool you on some of these. Again, I think it's a just a massive over-opening of collector's boosters. It does not take away from the quality of the cards that are in the set. Mantle of the Wolf. Big ol' enchantment. But that's what they do. That's what they do in the set. Big ol' enchantment. Okay, let's see if we can get our first mythic out of the way. Huh? Eat to extinction. It's a sweet looking card. I can tell you that much. And you're gone. You're dead. Come on. We're on the right side. The right side's normally the, the hot side for the mythics, but maybe not in this box. Maybe it's in the bottom left. They're hiding somewhere. It's my job to find them. And find them I will. Shatter the Sky, another really nice rare. Ooh, and that's beautiful. Transcendent Envoy. Envoy? I think that's right. Correct me if I'm wrong. I think it's an Envoy. Bring on the Envoy. Glory Bearers. Under the Uncommons, into a Temple of Abandon. Our first of the Scry Lands out of this set. The Skylands in Core 2020. Core 2020 seems to be doing well as far as uh, kind of reception and uptick. And Storm's Wrath. Nice solid board wipe type of card we got there. There's a couple of pretty decent board wipes out of here. I think Shadow of the Sky is going to be kind of the, the big takeaway with that draw card ability as well. All right, we got an Archon of Sun's Grace with the Swampy. Wow, we are, as of right now, we are opening into the first stack on the right. Not a single Mythic. Where are they hiding? Where are you, Mythics? Don't hide from me. I think there's one coming up. I can feel it. Ooh, Nyxborn Marauder instead. I was hoping there would be one hidden behind there. All right, we're on to the middle stack. The middle stack... Must be where it's at. It's just gotta be. 
It's got to be. Give Ryan some goodness here. For goodness sake. Heliod's intervention. I'm going to go on a run of booster therapy interventions. Only cure for your pack cracking addiction is to have us open more packs. It's the only way it can be cured. I'm afraid there's just no other way. Oh, there we go. Ashiok, Nightmare Muse. Beautiful. This is a sweet card. All right, well, we got our first Mythic. Got the monkey off our back. And it's a pretty good one. I think it's one of the better Mythics out of the set. Definitely not a miss. Zet is for sure. And there's a good old Hactos. Good old Hactos coming at you. Come on, I want more Mythics. I want them now. Here they come. Yep, there they are. Perforos Bronze Blooded. The beautiful constellation. Showcase. Alright, we're on a little bit of a run here now. Ooh, this is definitely a resealed pack, so it's probably got a Mythic in it. The way it opened. Oh, no, but it's got a sweet card. Enigmatic Incarnation. Oh, and that's a really nice foil rare. Shadow Spear. I don't know what the multiplier is, but this is around five bucks just for the regular. So that is a great hit. We'll put that in our rare pile. Man, that's a nice hit. Very nicely done. All right. Well, it wasn't a mythic, but it was a beautiful foil. As good as a mythic. Oh, we got Gary. Gary goes over here. And we've got Temple of Deceit. And a nice, nice little solid Scryland. Just a, a staple. Usually around a dollar for a card like that these days. Just a solid buck. And Allure the Unknown. Look at that, how creepy is that? Alluring the Unknown. Don't do it, man. Don't allure the Unknown. Stay away from that. Bad things will happen when you allure the Unknown. And Storm Herald. Big ol' Storm Herald. Alright, we're drying up on the Mythics. We gotta get them back here. Show me the Mythics. Where are you, Mythics? Where are you hiding? Right here? No. Atrus Oracle of Half-Truths. Alright, we're getting down to the bottom of the middle stack. I'd like to sneak one more Mythic in this particular stack to make me feel a little bit more confident going into the last stack. All right, Woe Strider. It's a very solid rare. Definitely gets played in Sacrifice decks. I didn't even know when it originally came out. I didn't even really read the card that you sacrifice another creature in Scry 1. On top of everything else. And the first Aroan games. No one watched them, the first Aroan games. Very boring. Real snooze fest at the Aron games. I don't know. No one knows. Not even the books. And Eidolon of Obstruction. With a planes. Man, where are our mythics at? We are sitting at a two stinker mythic box. We need to go on a run. Oop, another Gary. Gary was getting lonely over there. Oh, there's right on cue. Kiora Bess, the Sea God. With a foil swamper. A foily. Alright, we're up to three. And we've got a nice little foil. We'll just put them over here with the regulars. Have them blend in over there. Since you're getting them anyways. Come on now. I want more mythics. I'm a greedy little pig. And I want more mythics. Thassa's intervention. Probably the best of the interventions. As far as I'm aware, that definitely gets play in blue-white control. Alright, onto the uncommons. And, alright, we've seen him before. The Crafter of Wonders, Dalakos. If I'm saying that right. And if I'm not, too bad. 
You let me know after the fact. That's how I'm gonna. That's how I'm gonna say it. <clears throat> Come on now, we need something here. We need a big old mythic. No, we're not gonna get it here. Tyrannica, a Crowan veteran, and Eidolon of Philosophy. Put you there in our foil pile. Well, we've got a handful of packs left here. We are, we are due for some hits. Don't make it a sad box, make it a happy box. Ooh, with a grave breaker. Lamia, and, and look at the tactics, Phalanx tactics. Seems like a pretty good strategy. They'll probably hold. Stop the enemy forces. Come on, Mythics, where are you at? Labyrinth of Scopos. Coming through in the close here. We need more Mythics. We are sitting at just two. That's way too few at this point. Nissian Boar with a forest. Man, make it a sweat it out here. They better be bringing the heat here in the close. Otherwise, this will be an all-time poop box. We don't want that. Oh, there we go. Elspeth, the son's nemesis. They're saving him for the end. And Fairy's Band Brawler. Oh, I'm sorry. We're at we're at three before. We're up to four mythics. It's actually more than I'd thought. All right. Well, we're at four. Well, I'd still like to see more than four. Five is always my my target. My target minimum that I look to go for. Oh, Field of Ruin. Oh, I see another good one too. And Shadow Spear. You kind of got a double up on that. That's nice. And that one's virtually as good as a Mythic as far as value goes. It's a very solid hit. Alright. Come on, baby. Give us the goods. Yes, another Mythic. There it is. Kroxa, Titan of Death's Hunger. All right, we did make it there. We got up to five. We got two packs left. Can we get the six mythics? At this point, anything is possible. So I say, why not? Elspeth Conquers Death. Solid rare. Very, very solid rare. And a little scouter. All right, last pack, Ryan. Thank you very much for sponsoring this box and for supporting... Brett and I at Booster Therapy. We really do appreciate it. All right, final pack. Good luck. All right, you're going to get an Ephemia and an Impending Doom. Oh, that's scary. You don't want to end in an Impending Doom. End in a Mountain. End in a Seder. That's a better way to go out. But there you have it. Not too shabby. Got a nice little five mythic box there. So thank you once again to uh, Ryan for hooking us up here. And uh, I think I've got one more box left. So until next time, this has been Booster Therapy.